Hi guys, welcome back. We got Time Zone from Monoskin. Uh, it's a great song to play on the acoustic guitar specifically. But other ones like had some power chord stuff, but this one has a nice little special riff for the song. Really love it. I'll show you guys how to play the song without a capo, which might make it a bit hard in terms of the bar chords which we need to do. So if you want, I can make an easy version for the song too. You just need to comment down below. No capo, standard tuning. I love the song. I'll show you guys the chord series firstly, 4 chords, 1 main chord progression, E major, open 2nd second, 2nd, second, first open open. After that I have a G sharp 7 chord, I'll take my index, bar the 4th fret, put my middle finger on the 5th fret of G and my ring finger on 6th fret of A. Then I'll go to a C sharp minor chord again, I got the 4th fret, fourth fret barred, but I do have 5th fret on the B string. And I got 4th fret, I'm sorry, 6th fret on D and G. So we got mute, 4, 6, 6, 5, 4. Don't worry, I'll show you guys a uh, tab too. Then we have an A major chord. I'll advise you guys not to play it like this for the song. It's more like this. It's like an A major 7. I got D7, G6, B5, E4. Just like that. So... Since we are finger plucking, I'll show you guys my right hand to you. I'm using my thumb to hit the E string, as well as the D string, as well as the A string. So the top three strings pluck by the thumb. G string, index, middle finger, B string, high E string, ring finger, pinky, useless. So with that in mind, we have the first chord shape, E major. I'll simply hold the chord shape and then I'll do this. So easy. I'll hit the E string, then I'll play the D string, then I'll play the G string, then I'll pluck the B and high E string together, then I'll play the B string open, then G string. So you just have to hold the chord sheet and then you're doing the right hand. E, D, G, B, E, B, G. So one and two and three and four. When I go to the G sharp 7 chord, I do this. So, the tricky part, I hit the E string, and the D string, 4th fret, and the G string, then I'll do this. So I did a hammer on to a pull off from 5 to 6, back to 5 on the G string. It's a bit quick, so we got... See that? 1 and 2, damn. Then I'll play D6 and G5, so we got and then I'll go to the C sharp minor chord, I'll simply do this. A D G B G D. So A D G B G D. Got it? So easy, right? And then we'll do this. Now what I did is I played an E major. Then an A major 7. So I'll play D, G, B. Now try to put your index on the high E string 5th fret and plug the high E string. So 1 and 2, A. This is A note. So la 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 la. I'm playing like this. Da, 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 da. Then I'll play 4th fret on high E string. And then normal B5, G6. So la 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 la. What happens is when you capo up, this gets a lot more easy. You don't have to just like stretch and all, hammer ons, bar. We don't have those stuff. So that's the, uh, I'll say, advantage of using your capo. So we got. Sorry. All right. I hope the riff is crystal clear. I'll play the whole thing thoroughly for you guys.
for the chorus, I'll have the same chord progression, but I'll try to play power chords. We got E, I have 7th fret on A, D9, G9, top string and the bottom two strings meet it. So we got Ja Ja. Then I'll go to G sharp, which I played easily in the chord progression. 4th fret on E, 6th fret on E, 6th fret on D. Again, bottom two, bottom three strings made it this time. Now I'll go to C sharp five, so fourth fret on A, six fret on D, six fret on G. Just playing the top notes of the full chords. So you just play the one, the fifth, and the octave. So that's it. So we got da, 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 da. then A. So fifth fret on E, seventh fret on A, seventh fret on D. Again, when you're playing power chords, the string made it otherwise. It sounds cool, but not for the song. So we got two day intro. As soon as I'm done strumming, I lift off my right hand just to keep the sound of the chord music. So we got down, 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 And there you have it, that's how you play this song. Let me know what other song you want to learn from the new album. Uh, I think Monskin is, I don't think Monskin is actually a great band and I almost loved every song of this. Like I even don't usually listen to this kind of song a lot, but I really do love listening to Monskin. And um, I love how they actually uh, make the rock song sounds like. It's really, they are really actually a good uh, band, I'll say. Maybe, maybe like the best one which I heard. I really like the type of song which they make. Uh, in the sense, like I don't really listen to rock music, but I do love what stuff they are actually doing. So yeah, I hope the video helped you out. I'll see you guys back in the next video. And maybe until then, I'm out.